What are the risks associated with oversizing an air source heat pump? So oversizing is something people get very worried about, but actually they shouldn't. Okay, so essentially, if we have, let's say, a 10 kilowatt load in our house and we want to be careful and say, OK, I'm going to put a, a 20 kilowatt heat pump in just in case, it will work perfectly. But the first thing is it's going to be more expensive to buy. So the bit of kit is more expensive. And I like to liken everything to cars. So if I am going to spend my whole time driving around central London in my car, it doesn't make a lot of sense to buy a five litre engine. I'm not going to need it. So it's going to be a little bit more expensive to run because it's pooping along and it's too big for the job. Um, and I can tell all my friends it will go really fast, but I never actually do go really fast. So you're essentially spending a little bit too much money on the kit. Um, you're not getting as good a efficiency as you can. Heat pumps work really, really well between sort of 25 and 75 percent of their capacity. When they're running at very low speed or very high speed, they're not as efficient, a bit like a car. So oversizing means you tend towards um, this sort of really bottom end uh, performance, which can increase your run cost. It's a problem I actually have at home with my system and mine is oversized and the run cost isn't as good as it should be.